Moving on, we've got this courtesy of Stay Grounded regarding Travis Scott's latest collaboration with, yes, you guessed it, Audemars Pigot, also known as AP. They've got a chocolate AP here about to drop, which I guess is cool because I'm assuming AP have never made a watch in a chocolate brown colorway, but that's obviously Travis Scott's kind of signature color. But I'm just curious to know, like, who is this for? Like, who do you make this for? Because it's not as if, like, Trav is, like, trying to... It's different when you're a brand, right? When you're a brand and you're... you're bit, like, imagine if I... If you start a brand when you're 16, you've probably got 16 tastes and sensibilities. But as you grow up, your taste levels change. And you're hoping that as you grow up, your fans grow up with you. So that if you're 16 making hoodies, when you turn 35 and you want to make a suit, your fans might want to have the suit that you make because they liked your hoodies when they were younger and they're growing up with you. But Travis Scott's fans are all kids. Like, it's evident from the fucking, you know, the tragedy that happened in Astroworld, right? A lot of the people that died were, like, under the age of 21, if I'm not mistaken. I think 10 people that died, a lot of them were under 21. And if you look at, you know, his shows, you go to his comments and stuff, you just go to the live streams, like, they're all kids in the audience, like, absolute kids that go crazy for Travis. They love him. Cool. What kid that's between the ages of like 13 to 21 has the funds to buy an AP, <laughs> right? Even, even if they bug their parents for an AP, like how, how many kids out there are really going to be like, you know what? I need that fucking new Travis AP. I need it. I need it ASAP. Like, how, like what? And if I'm not mistaken, these watches are like, like how much is an AP? How much? is an ap i'm assuming they're like a hundred grand right how much is it uh oh no not that not apple watch i want, I want an ap i'm assuming they're like a hundred grand that's what i'm assuming One hundred let let's see let's see how much they actually go for oof 15 grand so let's say for fifteen thousand, right let we see here fifteen thousand pounds jesus christ like who's gonna what what parent is gonna buy their what their stead child a chocolate brown watch for 15,000. <laughs> Could you imagine? Could you imagine asking your mum and dad when you're 17 living at home? You don't wash you don't wash dishes, you don't wash your own clothes, you don't contribute to the rent, you eat all your mum's food and your dad's stuff, right? Do you know what I mean? You leave your dirty boxes all over the place, shit stains everywhere, right? You come back at all hours of the night, you piss them off. And then you ask them for Christmas, can I get a £15,000 watch, please? <laughs> like, excuse me? In chocolate brown also, most likely you're going to you're gonna get over this very quickly. You're not going to be into these watches, right? I'm assuming, like, you buy, a, you know, maybe if you get, like, a silver version of these watches, right? I'm not really into APs anyway, but if you've got one of these nice, maybe not that one. What's, why, why is that 300? There's a watch here on, on Depop. There's a deep there's a there's a there's an AP on Depop that's selling for three hundred and eighty eight pounds. I've got a feeling that isn't real, <laughs> considering the prices. There's one here for sixty pounds on on Depop. People are selling APs on Depop. That's a hilarious. But I would assume you could probably wear the fifty three thousand one, right? Fifty three thousand one silver, maybe a lot. It's like a Rolex. You could probably wear it often. But how often are you really going to be wearing a chocolate brown watch? Like, really? It's honestly interesting. Again, it's odd because I think I really like Travis Scott's collaborations. I love the ability, I love that he's one of the only hip-hop artists, maybe one of the only black artists out there who's, with the exception of the Astroworld tra tragedy, he's very brand-friendly. Like, he can... He, you can copy and paste him on any brand and he's going to do well. He's going to sell units. His merch does crazy numbers. The merch designs are amazing, right? Even the design of the watch, looking at the watch face and stuff, right? The little dials, it's pretty cool, right? The details in some of these little numbers and stuff has all been hand-drawn and I guess stamped on there. That looks really cool, right? The little logos to the straight. Like, it, it's fucking beautifully, cr you know, crafted and constructed and shit. It definitely is a, a marvel of fucking engineering in some ways, right? But honestly like the kids that he's that that support him and shit like i don't know maybe there is a contingence maybe there is a maybe there is a section of his fan base that has the money to splay on this sort of stuff maybe kids in the middle east or something 
Maybe he has those type of fans, or maybe there's kids in America even, um, private school kids who just, you know, love everything about Travis and go and see all his performances and shit and buy everything that he does, um, copy, you know, his taste in cars and shoes and shit. Maybe those people exist, but I don't know, man. I'm looking at this stuff and it's just like 15 grand watch. That's a wild collab. Like, and again, like his fans aren't getting any older. If anything, his fans are incredibly young still to this day. That's the funny thing about it. Like, they're not super old. They're just young. So, I'm interested to see what happens here. Um, reading the comments. I remember all those people that died at his show and he gave that half hour false apology. Lowe's. Um, why does anything Travis Touch turn to gold? 52 second minute watch. Got to lose track of time. This is so ugly. The worst crossover I've ever seen. Um, awful font. Fire as fuck. Another person said here, this collab makes zero sense. I ain't gonna lie, Travis did that. Um, pretty cool. The brand is a big L. Follow through on that line from Meltdown. It's a Timmy this. Um, world world's collaboration. So I, I understand for AP, they clearly want to, you know, get into the youth market. I get it. They also want to maybe make their brand to be a little bit synonymous with like quality watches. Maybe they want to take over from Rolex, right? Because at the moment in america especially if you get money the first watch people always get is a rolex so maybe they want to take over from there right richard millie is also doing a good job of doing it now and i think um ap are obviously trying to break into that market they want to get a bit of that market share but i just don't know if this is the right way to go about doing it maybe doing it with leaks of matthew williams makes a good sense but a uh, collaboration with travis scott when he's got mostly teenage fans is a bit interesting a bit odd but hey chocolate brand ap purchase it if you want it's available where you buy watches. I guess it's available where you buy fucking watches.